give them prayer hands. Say what's up, America? Half of you should know me, right? Other half a replica. What is going on guys? It is Fez finally back with a brand new video and actually ironically I'm wearing the same cutoff I wore in my last video. I know I said they look retarded and they're kind of gay but you guys got to understand it's fucking it's like 90 degrees outside and we don't mess with that kind of stuff in Wisconsin it's hot but anyways I gotta kind of tell you guys what's up I I'm I have not been on my upload grind like I said I would be so basically my daily routine is now I actually wake up at 5 30 in the morning yeah I'm, I'm not the biggest morning person but I have to do it because like I said I got that new job it's going really good it pays really well. I haven't got my first paycheck, but it's gonna be it's gonna be really nice. But uh, four days a week, I work from 6:30 around 6:30. I kind of punch in whenever they need my help. But it's around 6:30, 12:30, so it's it's a good like six hours. So four days a week, I'm doing that, and then I kind of have the afternoons to do whatever. And my thing right now is basically just to go fishing and screw meltdown. I'm not dealing with meltdown right now. Yeah, I'll take some express. But yeah, my main thing now is I basically just go fishing and like I said I said I was gonna go fishing with passion uh, I, I did me and passion went went fishing with another friend and it was it was really cool it was it was great he caught all the fish and I was pissed off but you know it's called it's called fishing not catching that, that's what someone told me once when I actually have this really kind of funny cool what the fuck I just twitched so hard. But I have this kind of funny, cool story. I honestly, I think it's just awesome. It's not like funny, but it's kind of funny. All right, so basically it's me, Passion, and another friend. I'm just going to say his name. His name's Brandon. So, you know, yesterday was my day off of work. So I called him up and I was like, yo, you want to go fishing? He was like, hell yeah. Okay, I'm making this sound really queer, but. But basically we, we've wanted to go fishing for a while and... I finally got a day off, so he just decided it'd be a good day. And so me, Passion, and then Brandon. So we get to this dam. It's known to be a pretty decent fishing spot. And I throw my pole in the water. Boom! Instantly catch a sheephead. And for those of you who don't fish, that is garbage. I fucking, I hate sheephead. I want to put a picture on the screen right now. I'll show you what a sheephead looks like. They're ugly bastards, I tell you. And basically, the only reason, like fishermen hate them is because one you can't eat them because they're just full of bones and you can't like fillet them or anything what the hell was that shot oh my god but yeah they're just full of bones you can't eat them and they're like an invasive species so they like kind of drive all the other species out so i caught the sheep head i throw it on the shore curb stomped the living hell out of it and then passion goes and catches freaking three catfish not did he catch three I think he caught three. I, he like he threw the first one back, and then he caught two bigger ones. So we ended up keeping those. And then Brandon caught one. And guess who didn't catch a catfish? Me. Okay, so now to the the funny or cool part of this story. So we're all just sitting there fishing, right? And I look up and I see that Brandon had a bite. So he waited for a little bit and then yanked because you gotta you gotta set the hook. And he was reeling in for a couple seconds. We're like, hey, all right, we'll see if this is another catfish. He could probably keep this one. So he reels it in for a little bit, and then out of nowhere, the line just snaps. So we're like, oh, dang, dude, that sucks. And it's also really annoying, because then you got to tie all your weights back on. You got to get a new hook and all that kind of stuff. Dude, I am going off right now. So after that, we all kind of just went back to doing our thing, just fishing. I think we caught a couple fish here and there. And about an hour later, I was like, hey, I'm not really getting a bite. We are using worms at the time. So I just decided to use like a, a giant jig. Like this thing was this big. Okay, get your mind out of the gutter. You know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about a lure, a fishing lure. Like this thing was this big. So I go downstream a little bit, like maybe 50 feet or so. It wasn't too far. I'm just sitting there, casting out, reeling back in. Just maybe seeing if I could catch a northern or something like that. Because, I mean, this lure was massive. So, if I caught something, it was going to be crazy. So, I cast out a few times. I don't really get any bites or anything. But then I cast out a little bit more downstream. I start reeling in. And I'm like, hey, that's weird. I kind of feel something. So, I reel it in. And on the end, there's the little curve of a line. Like, uh... Maybe the line broke, like just a line just laying in the water. So I'm like, uh, hey, maybe there's a lure on the end of this. Maybe I should reel it in and see what's up. So my hook's like attached to the line, right? I get it to the bank. I start reeling it in with my hand. I'm like, 
hey, I feel something on the end of this thing. And I start feeling, I'm like, dude, this feels like a fish. So I start reeling in with my hands, and I reel in a freaking fish. Like, I caught another person's line, and then there was a fish on the end of it. Like, it was crazy. It wasn't anyone in the area. It wasn't like a pole that was in the water. It was just a line. It was a broken line with a fish on it, and somehow I caught it. But, guess what it was? It wasn't a catfish. It was a freaking sheephead. I swear it had to be destiny or something. Because guess what? The, the really crazy part about this was not even, like, how creative I caught that fish. But guess whose fish hook it was on? It was Brandon's. So when he had gotten that bite before and it broke his line, he had a fish on. And I ended up catching the line that broke and I reeled in his fish with my hands. It was so cool. Like I've never had anything like that happen before. That was just like the coolest thing ever. So yeah, unfortunately that day it was like pouring outside. It was like nonstop rain for a while. I didn't really feel like it was the appropriate time to like vlog and whatnot. Cause uh, I wouldn't want the camera getting all wet. And then I uh, probably couldn't make vlogs again cause then I'd like destroy my freaking camera. But yeah, me and Passion, we're definitely going to start making some vlogs. He did a face reveal on his channel. You guys can check it out if you want. You guys know his channel. It's in my sub box. But yeah, don't worry. We're going to be catching all that stuff on video. Oh, shit, dude. I almost I missed the quad feed. Dude, I'm actually doing good while I'm making a commentary for once. That never happens. But uh, yeah, leave a like for that story because I thought that was pretty crazy. But since I've got my license, I've been doing so many more things. It's like, it's so crazy. Like last summer, I would never have done any of this stuff because I, I just couldn't go anywhere. So besides all that stuff, I do have a few other videos planned. Like I've been recording for a highlights video for quite a while and I've got a lot of cool stuff. Like I can show you guys that I actually do hit clips in my free time sometimes and I'm not that garbage. But I mean at the same time I'm not not that good. But you know, I can always try, right? Doesn't hurt. Bro, dude, I could have had something. And also one more video I do have planned is another gun game trick shotting video. I have like a little bit of the commentary done. I just need to like get some more highlights and maybe get a shot or two. I'm definitely gonna try and get a shot. Cause if I'm gonna make videos like that a series involving like specifically trick shotting I'm definitely gonna have a shot in them because I don't want them to be like boring I want some good quality videos but yeah leave a like and you Ugh, fuck, I can't talk leave a like if you enjoyed but yeah leave a like and you but yeah leave a like if you enjoyed and uh it's been Fez see ya I've been drinking for hours, yeah, I just caught a buzz Thinking about the old days, thinking back how it was Back when D-Money driving, had the liquor all packed Luke, he got the weed, girls was kissing him back I was driving illegal and I was drinking with people We had to do it all again like we can't wait for the sequel We would party at Wills, maybe turn up at Jamie's I was in the spotlight, really, how could you?